Before we start, I would want you to hit that red subscribe button so you never miss out on any of our videos. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to GTA Robot. Here is why GTA 6 may be super overhyped. Number 1. GTA 6 may be smaller at launch as Rockstar looks to reduce crunch. Over the past year and a half or so, Rockstar has been criticized for being one of the many video game developers that forces employees in a brutal crunch to finish its sprawling AAA games. Controversy erupted when Rockstar's Dan Houser said that teams were working 100 hour weeks to finish Red Dead Redemption, seemingly as a point of pride. But since then, things are apparently starting to change, which could have effects on future releases like Grand Theft Auto 6. Kotaku reports that due to reporting on all the various crunch issues at Rockstar, the company is trying to make significant changes to its culture and cites a number of employees saying that they see things getting better overall. It does seem like a healthier culture overall, a developer told Kotaku. We'll see in a year or two if I'm pulling my hair out, but it does seem like we're moving in the right direction for being a company the size we are. The Kotaku report says that despite GTA 5 released in 2013, that GTA 6 is still early in development, meaning it's most likely several, if not four to five years out, judging by how long these games usually take to get made. What's caused this delay is unclear, though obviously Rockstar also had the massive undertaking of Red Dead Redemption 2 in the past few years and has been supporting GTA Online constantly with never-ending updates. Number 2. Rockstar Games T Sparks GTA 6 Announcement Speculation Grand Theft Auto V and Red Dead Redemption 2 developer Rockstar Games updated its website on Wednesday. One new image revealed as a part of the update has fans in a tizzy about whether or not it means some kind of GTA 6 update is coming. The image in question appears on Rockstar's website when entering the search bar and is not listed with any of Rockstar's other wallpapers. It features a golden robot hugging Rockstar's R-shaped logo with a full champagne flute resting on the logo's star and a sealed bottle in an ice bucket next to the robot. The neck of the bottle, however, has the year 1998 on the label. The purpose of listing that specific year on the bottle is causing fans to speculate on Twitter. Another more practical possibility is that it honors the foundation of Rockstar and the start of the Grand Theft Auto series when the company was founded in 1998. The widely rumored Project America's leak suggests that GTA 6 is set in the past. Though that leak specifies the 70s and 80s, not the 90s. Still, the time period may have changed and this image could be our first legitimate clue. If the new game is set in 1998, that will put the game's story right around the events of the original Grand Theft Auto and Grand Theft Auto 2. A private video on Rockstar's channel is also making the rounds among the franchise's fans, with some believing that this could be a GTA 6 reveal trailer. Number 3. Either GTA 6 or This Mysterious New Game Rockstar Games debuted two new logos on its website last week and immediately kicked up a squall of speculations about what upcoming release the company may be teasing. So does it have something to do with Grand Theft Auto 6 or a new title? Rockstar's last major release was Red Dead Redemption 2 in 2018, and the developer has been holding down Grand Theft Auto 5 fans with a steady trickle of DLC content since its 2013 release. Hordes of Rockstar fans, however, have been scrambling to decipher what these two new cryptic logos might mean for the company's future plans. The second logo doesn't seem to include any hints of GTA 6, but instead could be referring to an unreleased Rockstar title that was long thought dead, originally called Agent. The unpublished PlayStation 3 exclusive was first announced in 2009 and was teased to be genre-defining stealth action IP that would take place in the Cold War in the late 1970s. It was supposed to pioneer a new style of spy-focused gameplay, but it never got off the ground. Rockstar stopped mentioning it after the launch of the PS4, but this new logo could be signaling a triumphant comeback. This brings us to the end of our video, I hope you enjoyed it. Hit like if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any of our videos in the future. Also watch the two videos that are on your screen because I'm sure you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in the next video.